hi and welcome to Mixed Media Friday. Today I'm making a two-page layout in the Small Dilutions journal and I'll be using one of the new Wendy Vecchi Stamp It Stencil It set.
right, so it's done. Can you guess in what kind of mood I'm in? <laughs> I'm kind of tired of winter. So that dark color that you see there, the kind of like dark gray, which I made myself using rubbing alcohol and black paint, represents the winter. And through this, we're seeing bright colors because spring is coming and that's my story and I'm sticking to it. Spring will come eventually, even though right now it is snowing. The background method that I've used uh, layering paints with stencils. That is a technique that uh, Giselle uses in her canvas tote bag class. So if you have a chance to attend that class, it's a lot of fun. And I know that she's giving it again in April. I used the stencil to create a mask. Um, so what I did is I traced the shape. I didn't use it as a stencil per se, except for the leaves or the little tree, whatever you can call it. Um, so I used this part of the stencil to create little masks and uh, glued them down with temporary adhesive just to hold them in place because my pages are a little bit warped. And then I sprayed the flower. I redid a little bit. Um, it was kind of too sketchy. I wanted the colors to be sort of solid colors so that it would pop. It kind of blended with the background. I didn't like it. And I created a stem and some leaves and I added some doodling here and there. I also added doodling inside the masked shapes just to make them pop even more. And the white dots uh, which adds bit of whimsy to the whole feel. And the handwriting, uh, I, I gave it some movement. I love the fun bright colors, of course, because I want to invite spring. Maybe because I made that page, spring will come, you think? <sighs> Let's hope so. That's it, guys. Thanks for watching. As usual, if you have any questions or comments, leave them below, and I will talk to you on Tuesday.